Hi, this is Jennifer Bell and Lilo, the unofficial therapy dog, back for another in our series of videos about EMDR therapy. In the last video, I talked about developing targets for EMDR. Those are targets that are used in what is called the standard protocol of EMDR. You start with a memory, you find thoughts, feelings, and physical sensations that go with that memory, and you use them to do the desensitization and reprocessing. But what do you do if the trauma happened before a client is able to form conscious memories? If you're doing talk therapy, you pretty much can't deal with those traumas. But there are forms of therapy that can work with those kinds of traumas, and EMDR is one of them. The preverbal protocol is one of my favorites, actually, and my clients have found it incredibly helpful, as skeptical as many of them were before they started it. Since we don't have memories to start with, we go by time periods, starting with the first, second, and third trimester of the client's mother's pregnancy with them. We set the stage by having the client think about anything they might know about what was going on in their family at that time. If they don't know anything about what was going on with their family, that's fine too. We just start with a general idea of what is happening in a child's development at that point. During each time period, we use the BLS or bilateral stimulus to help the brain to process any feelings and physical sensations that might come up. Once we have encountered and resolved anything that might have happened in that time period, we install a positive image before we go on to the next time period. Many clients, like Lilo over here, have attachment issues and therefore didn't get what they needed from their parents, especially early on in life. In cases like that, we might have the client picture what an ideal mother would do for them and install an image related to that instead. We go through up until usually around three or four years old when the client is able to have conscious memories. And then we would go to the standard protocol most likely. The preverbal protocol, while it sounds very strange and again, usually triggers skepticism at first, can be incredibly healing and many of my clients have found it profoundly helpful. Tune in for our next video where I will talk about EMDR and ants. That's automatic negative thoughts, not the insects.